starting mm -hmm. to play the game. Um, Freelancer Leo has gotten really good. Bunch of players. Helper has just always been solid. Stretch, like, mm -hmm. dude, New York City is full of killers. Oh, also Jen, Bonkai, like everyone in Dill. Flow is good. Dill, yeah. Dill, always <laughs> been good, yeah. Just look at the NY power ranking and you're just ridiculous. Yeah. And what's crazy is like none of you guys travel. And this is just like a New York City phenomenon even in real life. I don't think it's that much of a phenomenon. I think New York is expensive to live in, thus you have no cash to travel. Ah, uh, that makes sense. Well, no, no, it's still a, a New York City phenomenon. You know, it's, it's like a thing yeah. that is common in New York, like... People from the five boroughs barely know anything outside the five boroughs. That's why you guys call Westchester County upstate. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Even though it's like <laughs> literally touches the Bronx, it's not upstate. There's 99.999% of New York is north of it. But it's, up, it's upstate. Well, that's because like upstate, upstate New York is like Canada. So. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's true. So you guys just call that Canada instead. I, I'll never forget <laughs> we went to this tournament uh, upstate and we were just like, we could have went to PA twice, but in, instead we're driving five hours. Yeah, New York's big, man. You're but huge. so is its talent pool, and here we have, uh, I don't even know what seed these guys got, but not top two, because that was Angel and, and um, E. E. And they're both eliminated at third and fourth place, respectively. So we've got Queens versus Brooklyn. Very fitting. You guys share a landmass and also <laughs> are sharing grand finals. Of course, Benny yeah. on the winner's side. What's interesting about this is, like I said, the numbers actually did defeat him uh, most recently at last Wednesday. So... Um, maybe he's figured some stuff out. I know there were times where Numbers legitimately timed himself out versus Venia. Uh, you don't know. Like, like House as a crew, House as a team, House as a group just yelling at him, being like, what the hell was that? Like, play the game. <laughs> yeah. Fight. It's like, you know you have buttons that attack, right? Oh, man. So funny. I love how tricky John Numbers is from the edge. That deep breathing stuff is really tricky. Wow, <laughs> spawning the soccer ball, but it doesn't matter. Just gonna go right off the top. Okay, so num Numbers gonna be losing his first stock here. Uh, yeah, <laughs> gonna be pretty good for Venia. Okay, up there, up air, up air. 25, not too bad. Oh, trying to snipe him with a shuriken out of that deep breathing, but of course John Numbers very quick on those R triggers. John Numbers literally johnning mid set, or <laughs> no, not actually johnning, but complaining about something. Mm. <laughs> this is funny, man. I don't think anybody talks more during games than John. Yeah, may maybe Leo, but uh, maybe yeah. Yeah, I feel like only he'd only do it against John though. <laughs> <laughs> those, those are the top two of talking during a match. Yeah. Like, they could literally have a full conversation with each other. <laughs> yeah, with, like, the most animosity possible. Yeah, <laughs> the most one-sided animosity. <laughs> yeah, it's just nobody like, oh, okay. I don't think John has it in him to dislike people. No, the most of it is just disliking characters. Yeah. Okay, down tilt to forward air. This is looking real dominant for Venia here. Ooh, chat. Whoa, that was so dirty. That was really nice. So, like, seeing that he was going to go for the down air and just, like, rolling through and grabbing him, just going right back up. Somebody please confirm to me that this guy's going to Greninja Saga. Like, I, I don't doubt it. I'm pretty sure he See, is. See, the thing is, like, I asked Venia, and he was like, yeah. Uh, he was like, they're going to tell me. And I was like, okay, cool. And then, like, I'm seeing, like, all the ad, all the 2GG, like, tweets and stuff, and I'm just like, is no one, is, is no one mentioning Venia? They really, like, they better send this man out, if he, especially if he wins his tournament. Mm -hmm. But yeah. you know what? Honestly, if they don't fly him out, he should just use the winnings from his tournament <laughs> to go there just to spike them and win the Greninja round robin. They're doing one, I hope. I mean, it's a character saga. They better, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> At first, like when they were setting that whole thing up with all the, the character voting and stuff, I was like, wait, what is this? And that, I was like, oh, this is actually really cool. That was really funny with uh, just like the pool at, at uh, Civil War when there was just like, vote for, uh, what, what's his name? 
who won it? Renai. Renai, thank you. And it was just like, yeah, he apparently plays a god like Greninja and just like won that. Yeah, I don't even know how Renai's Greninja made it past the voting <laughs> stage, but boy, am I glad it did because it was so good. Yeah, it was crazy. I would not doubt that Renai could be like top one in the world with almost any character he picks up. Mm -hmm. Oh, chill. Wow, that was the down forward version of counter, which I can safely say I've maybe only seen once in my life. Uh, right, th right here, right yeah, now. Yes. Uh, Eight forty-six p.m. <laughs> April thirtieth, twenty seventeen. Yep. Eastern daylight savings time. Oh, he missed the tech. Oh, John Numbers wanted to reset him there. Of course, you can't tech a spike hitbox if you're already knocked down, and then you get that free guaranteed stand up. Uh oh! <laughs> wow, he took him away from the ball. He actually uses the ball as a means to like get that little boost up to grab the edge. Uh huh. So that's great. That's like, oh, he interrupted his recovery that way, but it's not his up B. It's not going to put him in special fall like that. Nice wait. Ooh, I like I like him going extra deep for that. Not going to be enough though. Yeah, battlefield extra big blast zones, and I feel like that probably wouldn't have killed anywhere. Mm -hmm. Maybe Town and City on the stubby edge. John Numbers just unable to time the F tilt on the pop out of the ground too. If, if you're able to get that like right when they are ungrounded, you I get the full knockback. I don't think he looks for it. Yeah, I, it doesn't I think look he like he literally just like just tries to hit him. Yeah, it's probably worth the damage. I know he occasionally. Uh, yeah, probably definitely worth the damage. I know he'll occasionally do the run up, charge up, smash, and try to catch you when you pop out. Yeah, yeah, because that's crazy. Yeah, that will kill it, what, like 60, 70%? I'd say probably like 75. It's really strong, but it's not like Bowser strong. <laughs> yeah, or Lucas. Yeah. Oh, boy, oh all God. those crunches, man. The double jackknife. And now he's... Wow, he actually landed the smash attack, so then We Fit gave us uh, some tips. Smash attack 18. <laughs> oh, yeah. there we go. Finally killing him cross stage. Was that a taunt, or is that just a weird idle animation? I think it's uh, his idle. Okay. Uh-oh. Your lower oh. body. No combo after the forward air. I'm actually kind of surprised. That looked like a clear follow-up opportunity. And jab definitely would have been what you would want to go for. Oh, man. Oh, Venia, he's moving right now. He knows he's down, but not out. Oh, but he's out now. Okay, Venia with a smile on his face. He's like, oh, man. All right, I was going for a sec. All right, here we go. Going into the now third game of the set, first set of grand finals, of course. This is this is one of the weird things, like because of the way that number just plays. You don't really know what stage he would really pick or ban. Well, okay, no, he's gonna auto ban Lilat. Oh yeah, he's yeah. one of those. Yeah, good on him. <laughs> what <laughs> what did Lilat do to you, man? It's done where, so did, many did terrible hurt? things over the years. Where did it did hurt it? you? Show me where it hurt you. <laughs> Show me on the blast the, just zone. point to the whole stage. Oh my god. Basically, any degree of Lilac shenanigans that can happen have happened. Did this exist in Brawl 2? Yeah. Okay. Terrible stage. Anyway, <laughs> here we are. Grand Finals, Game 3, Set 1. Venia, after completely bodying John Numbers, kind of got bodied by John Numbers. And now we're seeing a bodying. Yep. Back on that train. But, of course, John's going to hide on the edge. Try to recover a little bit of health, maybe frustrate Venia. But I think, you know, they've played enough to the point where Venia isn't going to fall for this game. Mm -hmm. Like I said, uh, there was legitimately a set between these two where Numbers timed himself out. He was literally down in percent and would jump from the edge, holding back just to grab the, gra the edge again. Did it for three minutes straight. And Venia was just like, okay. Yeah, he just threw shurikens. It was amazing. I don't worry about nothing. And this has become significantly more even. Mm -hmm. John Numbers just landed a Sun Salutation, brought Venia to like 37%. And then since then, Venia seemed to kind of waver in patience just a little bit. Mm -hmm. Oh, you could tell he wanted to be reverse that Shuriken. And had he done so, he would have kept it charging and maybe like fallen down with John. Mm -hmm. Try to beat out that air dodge and kill him with the full charge one. It's Ooh. actually pretty nice uh, that uh, Greninja's back air is like a multi-hit thing. So that when he hit him 
out of header, like he just becomes right. like the most needy thing ever. Ooh, okay. I like that damage control. He saw that he wasn't going to hit him, and he went past him. He just went fade right back. Catches him throwing too many shurikens at the edge, though. Yep. Full sun sanitation going to breeze right through that. Oh, man. And John Numbers actually taking the first stock after kind of getting a little bit slapped. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, he did the most recent slap, so. Right. Momentum was on his side entering Ooh. this game. And also, Hydro Pump, even though it's like a water wind box, mm -hmm. it still does damage, so it actually will knock the soccer ball away. Yes. Actually, one thing, uh, you, like, Greninja's can kill you off the top with it. Like, if he knocks yeah. you up and then yeah. does that. He actually killed Dill with that once. Okay, Venia sticking to that patient game. But, again, John Numbers, one of those players where you really need to cause some kind of commotion. You need to make it happen. Otherwise, it's just going to sit on the edge of camp you until the cows come home. Mm -hmm. And they come home approximately six minutes from the start of the game. Very orderly. Very consistent. Yeah. <laughs> you can always count on them. Okay, let's see. Who's going to make this breakaway here? They're roughly tied in this 50% range. This is also, of course, the tiebreaker within the set. It's going to give counterpick advantage to the winner. So yep. I know nobody is really trying to give up this game. Yeah, this is the game one of, of uh, the best of three. Right. Okay, hits it away with Hydro Pump. Yep, uh, actually the ball hit it right back into her. So she actually took... Fell <gasps> no way. Wow. Okay. Good Lord. Tracking him there. Now numbers up. Uh, oh, wait. Let, let's show... Uh, Oh, we paid to fifth or something? All right, here. Helper going plus one dollars. Making a whole... For entering today. God damn it. <laughs> Made it rain two rain droplets. <laughs> like, it, it was like blip, bloop. Oh, wow. my God. Well, hey, man, at least you didn't go negative, right? Dude, we pay, so you, we paid out to top six or top eight? Top six. Okay. Thank you for saying top six and not top not five. Not top five. I hate that. Definitely a pet peeve of mine. Yeah. Some people say, like... Yeah, I got uh, 32nd at a tournament, and, like, they don't know what the placings are. It's like, dude, how long have you been going to tournaments? Like, I'm saying, like, veteran players will say mm -hmm. this. Yeah, I, I got 15th at the tournament. Like, no, you didn't. <laughs> Nobody did. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> got 15th. Well, well, I'm pretty sure it was Apostle who hosted tournaments in the Brawl Days where he actually used the lower number. So, like, how it's 5th place, it would actually be 6th place. That's weird. You know, make make you feel bad. Yeah. And I remember uh, I forget what carrot what player, but they both brackets were posted on Smash Boards, one with that way and one the other, and it was just like I like that bracket more because I placed higher. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Mm -hmm. But I mean, it is more accurate. Like you tied for fifth, and the next guy is tied for seventh, etc. Mm -hmm. okay. All right. So now we have numbers on. Uh, well, Venny is on his winner's bracket life, quote unquote. Quote unquote. Yeah. And uh, Venny is trying to make sure that doesn't happen. Just right now doing a two to one ratio of hits right now. Of damage. Yes. Yeah. And we're going to see just how long he can hold on to that lead for. Because the last two games, he started off so strong. And John Numbers was just able to just pull ahead and stay ahead. Yeah, because like he just couldn't find that window to like land the kill move. And that's kill move right there, but because he was actually doing too good a job not getting hit, he doesn't have the rage to finish them all. Yeah. Okay, and now landing this... <laughs> nice. <laughs> now landing this kill is going to be the toughest part here because when John Number senses danger, he pretty much just goes to the edge and stays there. Mm -hmm. And you really do kind of have to put yourself at risk of losing a stock just to peel one off of him if he's playing that kind of game. Mm -hmm. But again, the timer is there to keep him honest. I don't know why numbers actually like fell for that. Like when you see him like just gonna be spamming uh, short hop fair, short hop fair. It's like uh, I think he's gonna short hop fair. It is kind of tough to do something about that though, because it's a lingering move. It's one of those like catch air dodge type things. It's also very safe on block. Yeah. Ooh. Chopping him up. John Numbers tried to respond with the down air. Just a little bit too slow on startup. And of course, using that little hover he gets from the header. 
actually like that Venier went out for do that, that one F tilt, just try and like back him off. Fortunately, unfortunately it missed. Okay, he's gonna grab the edge. Oh, Venia trying to sweep him off with dash attack. There we go. Work the second time. All right, Venia, are you going to be able to close this one out, bring it to Ooh. a game five, or are we gonna see the reset? Question of the day here. We know that John Numbers can kill you at pretty much any percent because of the header mm -hmm. spike hitbox. And man, she sticks her <gasps> head up from the edge. Like, yeah. Depending on what frame of her idle animation yep, it she is. She does pull ups. There you go. Yeah, yeah. What a poor decision. Like, not the time, lady. You gotta hit stay down so you don't get chopped. Can't just do like the the, the dead hang or whatever. I don't know. Yeah, flex the arm hang. Yeah. yeah. Shouts to uh National Physical Fitness Tests <laughs> in elementary school. Ooh. I feel like that was ill advised. Uh oh. It's getting real close now. Of course, Venia going to save the kill throw for when it's actually going to kill. <laughs> I would hope so. I mean, he could have made a, an ill-advised attempt there. Uh-oh. What are you going to do? John Numbers, I mean, like, we think has the distance for sure with her, her up B. Mm -hmm. It's going to be pretty hard to just straight up kill her with the water. And Venia catching the second ledge grab with a dash attack. Just oh. piling on more damage. That's... He wanted to do it again, but he actually got caught. Oh my by the god. Header. Oh my. Oh, he expected John Numbers to go for the jump, but I think he actually had already mashed his jump out. Either way, up throw gonna seal the deal. John, John Numbers looking actually the least upset I've ever seen him after a loss. <laughs> <laughs> it's it it's completely based on the character he's playing against. It's insane. Wow, so I mean I wouldn't be mad if I lost Wii Fit Cloud because I know that's like a terrible matchup, whereas Greninja, it's totally doable. So Yeah, no, see that's Shouldn't that's, he be more upset right no, now? No, it's the opposite. It is that character's not BS. Yeah. I think that character is BS. Right, you know, right. Like, oh, no, wow. I, it makes sense both ways. I totally get it. I don't know. Guys, don't don't complain about matchups. Just play the game or don't. <laughs> yeah, you have two choices. Yeah, really. You can you can express frustration, but there's a limit. Mm -hmm. That limit, <laughs> <laughs> definitely the source of many frustrations. <laughs> He's just like, I get the charge for final smash. But hey, man, the highest place in Cloud at this tournament was fifth, and now we have a Greninja versus Wii Fit trainer mm -hmm. grand finals. So, I mean, this is kind of looking like Civil War, dude. Does the tier list even exist? Yeah, except even now we don't even have a top tier in the top three, unless you count Marth. I would count Martha Messina, yeah. All right, no th in top two. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Ooh, the drag down, and that was not even techable because he didn't get the knockdown. Yep, oh. Actually, that was air dodgeable right there, but Benny is still able to Ooh, attack wow. some damage on. Oh, that would have been so sick. Yeah, they, uh, the Up air throw. dodge. Yeah, air dodge bait. bait. Okay. I, love, I love it when numbers of spacing just lends itself to, oh, you whiffed, I'm going to blast you. Just yeah. Just hit up destruction right there, you know? That projectile charges really quick. Mm -hmm. I mean, it just seems like it charges faster than anything else. I got to check the frames on it. You <laughs> taste the sun. So he can kind of just freely throw them. It's not like he needs to save it, say, like Samus, who can't even charge in the air. She's got to save that for the opportune mm -hmm. moment. Whereas Greninja... Doesn't really have to care so much. I'm sorry, we fit trainer. Which, by the way, every game, why why was it a decision to make it that Samus can only charge in on the ground? That I do not know, man. I, I wish I had an answer for you. I wish like every as every Smash game, I was like, they're gonna they're gonna change that. I was really I had high hopes for this one. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> I did too. They're like, no way, four times in a row. <laughs> it's like, no, this is not what Samus does, and I'm just like, why? I, I don't know. I'm I gonna, guess it was not a programming I'm gonna, website. I'm going to turn on Metroid Prime, jump in the air, and charge my shot. Send it to Sakurai on Twitter. Like, tweet it at him. Be like, what are you doing? <laughs> but it, She'd be too broken if she could, obviously. Yeah, mm -hmm. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> we've got John Numbers taking the first stock of this match, and that kind of bodes well for his chances of landing the reset here. Mm -hmm. And so does every single percent he lands from now on. Numbers' play style is definitely heavily... Uh, up, relying on that momentum of taking that first stock, because like now uh, he lost his stock, but he has the lead. 
Yeah, he's a player who I would not consider very good on the offense, but ridiculously good on defense. Yeah. I mean, we're talking about him on the ledge, like, all the time. Yep. It's not a very offensive position. Right. And rarely do you ever see him even, like, voluntarily go for something offensive. Mm-hmm. He only does it for, like, mix-up grabs to kill. Wow. Boy. Wow. This is looking good for numbers. Yeah, I think we're going to see a second set here. I forecasted the tournament being done at 9. It's now 9 on the dot. So, so if any can make something happen right now. Oh, wow. What, what are we? Oh, that's it. No, it's not. Her toes ain't strong enough, dude. Yeah. <laughs> well, they are. You particularly want to hit with them, but not the late hitbox. Wants to hit with her soles, not her toes. <gasps> oh! Yo! Wait, what? what? Happened? That was nutty. Okay. Well, John what? Numbers able to reset the bracket here. Let's see that again. Let's see that again. What? Excuse me? Wow. He hit him, I think, with both the back air and the back air soccer ball. Lord. Okay, so set two starting up right now. Let's see. Does Venia have what it takes to close this tournament out, or is John Numbers just going to do him in two sets in a row? So that was game five, right? Yeah, it was. Yeah. Okay. So, I, I mean, hey, one, that's just that's another set that Numbers actually taking off Venia. Like, you can yep. actually see there is a bit of a shift here. Yep. Which, all right. Yeah, John Numbers really just seems to still be improving, mm -hmm. which is kind of surprising to me because for a while he seemed stagnant for a bit. You know, it was like... Yeah, it's no, I can agree cold. to that. I feel like um, ever since like the midpoint of the last season of 2016, like mid December, I feel like a lot of the players have been like finally making that that leap. Right. So now we just gotta get our passports. Get, <laughs> you get don't our, need a passport to go tickets. out of state, my man. Come on. I I don't know. Everything's a new country. Anyway, get our passports. Get our tickets. Yeah, I mean, if Westchester's upstate for you guys, facts. like, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see. John Numbers off to a real solid start here. Venia definitely not out, though. We've seen Greninja has some crazy kill confirms like that. I was going to say down tilt to up smash. Could very well kill right now. Yeah, that's a scary reset. It's not exactly a combo. It's one of those things where it's just like you have very limited options against it. So if you make the wrong read. It wow. definitely is a true combo on some characters. Oh, yeah? Yeah. All right, then I guess oh. not on her speed. Or he's just going to get the raw anti-air up smash. Close out the first stock of the second set here. Even the crowd rooting for Greninja. Yeah. They love me. You know Numbers is able to accurately predict who they're going to root for every single time and when they're going to root for it? Okay. Uh, there's actually a trick to it. Uh, okay. It's when you trade hits and one character is above 100%. They'll cheer for the one who's above 100. But I don't know if they're both above 100 how that works. Okay, because, like, numbers will be like, they're going to root for this for X. And then you're like, God damn it. Yeah, no, no, there, there is a trick to it. There's some science behind it. It's not He's not some kind of savant psychic <laughs> of the game. I mean, he kind of is, but, like, not in that way. Yeah. Not, not for that specifically. Mm -hmm. And actually, numbers were uh, evening up the stocks, not taking much damage at all. Yeah, if I'm uh, not wrong, that was actually an outward hit of down air that killed him. Yep, uh, her shins yeah. just send you flying. Yeah, kind of like Falcon. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Let's see where Venny is able to take this, though. He has a 20% lead. Whoa! Whoa. That was like okay, warp to, speed to, right to, there. To be fair, Venny has been uh, mashing down air out of the grounded state every single time he's gone grounded. I see. Oh, almost some sick combos there. I think it's a combination of the, the start of down air makes him jump a little bit, and then because you're already flying out of the ground, it looks like he's going warp speed. <gasps> oh. We're getting some crazy momentum here. Wow. Actually clips the top of her head right there. Actually, I don't think so. I think uh, she spawned the ball on the oh. hitbox. Oh, and okay. It just smacked her in the face. Okay. Yeah, imagine you were about to serve a ball, and then the ball just went flying in your face. Because a mystical frog shot a <laughs> water shuriken at it. Mm -hmm. Then I'd be even more confused. Yes, he wanted that air dodge read, but didn't quite get it. 
I like him using the header there to like bounce off the stage where uh -huh. it gets like no speed at all. So now it's just like this falling hitbox. Yeah, he was definitely hoping Venia wouldn't be watching his back. It's like, oh, you thought you were edge carding me, sir. Mm -hmm. <gasps> That's dumb. not it. No. Okay. With deep breathing, absolutely would have been it. Mm -hmm. When she goes Kaioken. <laughs> yeah. She's red, dude. She's all focused. Oh, no way. That actually killed him Yo, off the top. Did? Wow. <laughs> Yo, Benny is not having it right he, there. He is definitely slightly upset, to say the least. Oh, my lord. Okay. Wow. Final numbers. That was like one of those melee deaths where it's just like, they didn't die, they didn't. Oh, 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 he exploded. All right. Yeah. No sparks, no nothing. Mm hmm. That's like the, the optimal percent, like any 1% per, lower, one to kill. Okay. Here we are. Smashville again. That was Smashville just before, yeah? That was in town? That yeah, this is Albin town. Uh, Albin Smashville. Okay. The worst bill. The worst bill? I hate this Man, stage. you and Angel both. I love this stage personally. Stage is garbage. People are like, most neutral. I'm like, are you insane? I don't know about that. Platform Chan rolls up, just messes everything up. And you're like, get out of here. Yeah, the platform is definitely uh, pretty significant interference. My, my stage bias is Town is my favorite stage. Best stage in the game. Ew. 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 Gross, Ev man. Everyone dies. Yo, straight Best up. Best every everything. Every stage in this game sucks. <laughs> they all suck. Battlefield, I would say, is the best stage, but then it has that left edge no. spaghetti. Yeah, the, the cubby. It has a yeah. little cubby. Yep. And uh, it has crappy ledges. Yeah. And then Battle or FD has the flash, but FD's probably... You know what? It pains me to say that FD might be the best stage. I think FD's fine. I like FD. Yeah, there's nothing, like, really wrong with it. The flash isn't that bad. Whoa. Yeah. That oh forward air, man. Such a gimmicky angle. It's like every other forward air doesn't hit like that. This one's just up forward and down back. I feel like, I don't know, if he had just like turned around and shot it first, then ran, because it, it, the, the, the sun goes faster than he runs. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Man. I, I think, I think Venny is uh, kind of losing his cool here, because... I don't know. I feel like any time when there's a kill, it's kind of like really close. Oh. But, you know, there we go. He's paying back with it now. He might be losing his cool, but he definitely had a fire lit under his ass right there. Yeah. That was the motivation he needed, man. Let's see. Is he going to be able to run this set back? Because, I mean, I swear, like every game in the first set looked like he should have won. Based on, like, at least the early interactions. Nice. Whoa. I feel like even at zero, that would have been really devastating. Because her spike is no joke. Yeah, it's actually really strong. Particularly the side B spike, though. Like, mm -hmm. it makes the down air look soft. Uh, I still think the down air is still pretty darn strong, though. Okay. All right. I think Vinny has actually, like, reset his composure. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like he's not a player who really loses cool like that, but Civil War. maybe I'm wrong. Oh, really? Anyway. Uh, I don't know. You'll have to tell me later, mm -hmm. but... Oh, it definitely was so obvious that Numbers was going to air dodge there. I feel like Venia should have waited, but I don't know. Numbers has been air dodging like immediately out of everything, and there we go. Snipes him with the water shuriken. It's actually the first time. The board. First time I've ever seen the shuriken like hit him like Off stage? Like he's always dodged it ever. It was because the deep breathing activated just then, and he mm -hmm. was like, oh, I'm good. Like, there's a few constants in the in the world, you know? <laughs> like, elements, John Numbers air dodging the shirt. Like, <laughs> guys, we can't have the fabric of reality unfold. Death and taxes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, so here we are again at the, the game one of game three of the set. All right. Basically a best of three at this point. Mm -hmm. For realsies this time. No take backsies. What was the what was the progression of set one? Was it numbers then Venia? I think it was no, Venia. No, I think it was numbers. Venia numbers. Okay, so this time. Venia numbers numbers, yeah. Yeah. I believe both of these guys have won a smash stack in the past. Yes. Yeah, I, I distinctly remember Venia winning one. Yeah. Um I don't has numbers won one that we streamed? 
I'm not sure. I think he won like one of the older. No, yeah, in ones. the spooky days. Yeah, yeah, it's possible. I remember seeing him in grand finals against the Buzz before. Yeah, but did not win. Always Yo, comes I, scarily close though. I feel like John Numbers is like the Buzz Light. <laughs> the Buzz Light. I could see that. <laughs> I mean, he doesn't have the lips for it, but you know. Wow! 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 Black Excuse me. Fast. Excuse me. <laughs> Esports <laughs> etiquette. <laughs> Oh my! But I mean, honestly, not even the Buzz camps this hard. Not even close. No, this is this is a special brand that is only capable through John Numbers. Limited edition. <laughs> Craftsman tents. Artisan. John John should get sponsored by Craftsman because they they make the tents that you can get in the stores. Wow! Absolutely destroyed there by the water shark off the stage. Then one of those global constants you were talking about. Actually, just not coming through there, dude. It, it, things are gonna. I'm gonna come into work tomorrow, and they're gonna just like everything's gonna be backwards. Be like, what happened? They change like the employee security code. Yeah. Just to actually be completely inverse. All right, let's see. What do you have, Venia? You have only 11 damage on you, so if you lose this, I will be moderately upset. It will be upsetting, yeah. Ooh, almost a shield break, but even if it broke, he literally would not have been able to kill him by any means. Venya's doing a fantastic job just try staying out of numbers' range the, this entire game. Yeah, I feel like he's just toying with him at this point. 11 damage. Like, John knows he's not winning this match. I mean, maybe he is. There's this thing that, like, when numbers, again, when he plays against uh, characters he hates, right? And he'll be like, he'll say mid set, he's like, I lost, right? And so then me and Dill will be like, run off the stage then. One time, he did that to me. I zero to death him immediately with Falcon. I Keep in mind, I had never lost to him at this point ever in my life. Uh -huh. I zero to death him, and he's like, I lost. <sighs> I lost. And I got so tilted by that because it was like, oh, I hate when I when people say this. It's mm -hmm. so irritating. And then I lost. I was Oh man, I want to like, yeah, no, I want to pull a John Numbers and just rage out of the it's, venue. It's but. the it's because you build a lose lose situation. Yeah, and it's just like, bruh. Yeah, it's but like, uh, you could have just not said anything to me. Mm -hmm. Like that would have been nice. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah, no, he's in. Like Dill would yell at him. You're like, run off the stage, or then. Yeah, yeah. You think you lost? also making it worse. I was up two one at the time, and then he won the whole set. Ah, uh, damn. Uh, I was tight. I was, I was not happy. All right. So but that, that was a long time ago, so, so now let's go back to the present. Tournament point. Are we going to... If he can replay what he did just last game, this is going to be a wrap. Like, easy. Hey, man, do what you just did. Exactly. Like, put in the exact sequence of points. Just do it again. Like, oh, oh boy. I think I think, uh, I think he's doing it. Oh, Venia. Oh, already took more than 11%, so something's changed. Yeah, true. I think he finished the match with like 33 or something. Mm -hmm. Just hanging on the edge. Nice. I like that by Venia. Just faking him out, baiting him into the neutral getup, which John Numbers does so frequently. Oh my god. All right. Numbers definitely like changing his behavior on the edge. Doesn't want a repeat of the last game. Oh, be had. Ooh, could have charged up, but also he would have fallen to the ground and gotten the sour spot. Yeah, uh, yeah. anytime you have those, those charge situations, you're it's like hindsight's twenty twenty. You're like, I could have yeah. just charged my down smash. Yeah. Uh, I could have picked the other fifty in the mm -hmm. fifty fifty. It's like, dude, I would have won if I didn't lose. Yeah. And you're like, wow, shut up. <laughs> Very true. <laughs> Astute observation. Mm hmm. Okay. Will this be the end of the tournament or not? Is the big question right now. I I kind of feel, mm, I don't know. I feel like Numbers actually making good uh, speed to taking the first stock, and the fact that he didn't die to that is kind of incredible because it almost shut me up. Yeah, I actually definitely counted him out right there. Yo, he, he super boosted the, the ball with the uh, sun. Power of the sun. Oh catapulting my. soccer balls all the way across the stage. Ooh, whoa. All kind right. of a... Okay, guys. Scramble up there on the top platform, but yo, I think Town and City might make up throw. Yeah. Oh, whatever. Okay. Doesn't matter. But up throw with all that rage might have killed. Yeah, I, I think almost definitely. I 
think if never mm. well, all right got that snake back air yeah the bathtub <laughs> that's the yoga pose <laughs> that's what it's called i mean that's one of the names we used to have right. for in brawl for snakes back air i yeah, never heard it hit you this. so hard it was like dropping a bathtub on you i see all right i love how venia is sniping out the soccer ball by the way with shurikens and just making mm -hmm. we fit take damage for it but you Ooh. know what's crazy even beyond that is that John Numbers doesn't seem to show any signs of stopping. He doesn't care. He's <laughs> like, ah, whatever. I'm just going to throw it. He's like, all right, Brian. You're not, like, giving me that much damage. Ooh. Ooh, that was clean. Used back air specifically so he could beat out the air dodge. I think he still has his jump, though. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's not really going to be that effective against We Fit. Mm -hmm. Against Marth or Lucina? Yeah. Definitely. <laughs> I oh, my God. Yo. Oh, that was so clean. That's the tournament. Venia wins 3-1 to one in the second set. Wow. After game five, uh, yeah, 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 set one. Good Lord. Well, congratulations to our new champion. Mm -hmm. Did Smash he win Zeno on Wednesday? Who? Venia. No. No. He lost to... Oh, John Numbers. Yeah, duh, I forgot. I, I, someone else. I completely reversed the direction of the things we were yeah. talking about before. I, I, who won? I don't know.